could actually if, if the damage is not so severe it could actually fix itself on its own yes when you just withdraw from some certain things that you suspect especially i told you in my last video a lot of cleansing and using um a product that would strip your face off its moisture example is the sls <music> Case the jam maker. Hello, YouTube. Oh, I'm meeting all of you in the best of health. If you're seeing me for the first time, my name is Asma Zakari. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not, and don't forget to hit the notification bell as well. Thank you so much. All right, today is the repair how to repair your skin barrier when it's damaged. Exactly. Now, um, your skin barrier is damaged, and so what? Restoration, yes. Okay, now. The skin barrier um, damage could actually have a certain limit. Yeah, what I mean by a certain limit, it could actually be just a slight damage. It could actually be a high damage. Now, technically, whatever um, degree of damage depends on the time it's going to heal. If your skin barrier is badly damaged, it's going to take a little bit longer to fix. Now, as complicated as it might sound, when this, your skin barrier is damaged, you need cleansing. But as I said, you try to cleanse with um, products that will not strip your skin off its moisture. You understand? At this point, you need proper cleansing because most of the time, your pores are tight. There's no room for penetration of any uh, product you want to apply. You understand? So, of course, proper cleansing. But the proper cleansing should come with um, products that are safe on the skin. Yes. When the skin barrier is damaged, repair for certain, restoration for certain, we talk of the ceramides, we talk of the um, fatty acids, and then we talk of um, cholesterol. Yes. Now, these are things that, these are products, they are all oils, actually. The ceramides mimics the skin lipids. Like, it has the same formula as the skin lipids. So, definitely, when your skin barrier is damaged, as I said in my other video, which I will link below the description box for you to go back and watch, the moment the skin barrier is damaged, automatically, you're having issues of lipids. And what are you supposed to do? You're supposed to return these lipids back. Very, very important. The ceramides, which is the most popular, is what is used to fix the skin skin damage cholesterol also is also good now example of cholesterol is like let's say the sunflower oil the argan oil all those are oils that you could actually use to fix the skin barrier damage now um then the fatty lipids like all these lenoic acids you could actually use them to fix your problem you understand but then fixing the problem does not end there what exactly is it that you do that even caused that problem as i said in my last video it could be overuse of products it could be wrong use of products in fact it could also be sunlight exposure sometimes yes now when you're losing fat when you're losing um, your lipids it comes also as well with um losing more of like moisture from your body so also replacing with moisture also is important like in repairing moisture drink a lot of water there is nowhere you will go that they will tell you water is not good for the skin so i'm going to tell you that's the solution to most skin problems drink loads and loads and loads of water now your skin damage could be that bad that you could actually be recommended some supplements i remember there was a time i was making um i had order to make a lot of soap so i was making a lot of soap most of the time so my hand was drying out so badly do you know i had to go using hand cream was not even good enough i had to go as far as buying omega-3 yes to consume inside supplement to consume inside, so that it could increase my um oil yeah it could increase so that my hand could restore i could restore my hand yes my hand not even my face so sometimes it could get that bad and you cannot really um wait for it to with you cannot really rely on product only you could actually use both the products and you could also take supplements and then stay away from sun and then using of sunscreen is also very very important it is when you attain the age of 30 your lipids drops by about 30 percent or so when you reach 40 about 40 percent yes so our lipids drop so automatically you don't need to wait for it to drop and then you begin to now look for solution to your problem if you have skin issues you could you know from your 20s you could begin to nurture your oils like 
after moisturizing i keep telling people you use oils i keep like i am virtually like right now some of my um clients that i are using my products i virtually shove oils down their throat like you must use oil yeah because they don't even know the benefits of that no it's going to increase oil no you get to a certain point in your life you actually need that increment of oil in your body if you even know that your oil is even decreasing do you understand because some they feel you're increasing you not knowing that in the real sense the oil is even dropping this few tips on how to repair the skin barrier don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel thank you so much for watching my video and i hope to see you again in another video thank you bye